Choosing the right material for your bar or kitchen countertop can be a challenge because you want something that will look good when you install it and meet your expectations over time. While everyone's choice will be different, there are a few factors that everyone should consider before making a decision. Whether you're a homeowner selecting materials for your kitchen or a restaurant owner selecting materials for your restaurant, the two main things to consider are the aesthetic and how much maintenance each material requires. In addition to thinking about how you want your countertop to look, also think about the foods you prepare and how they might affect your stone surface. Acidic foods such as tomatoes and lemons can change the composition of stone over time, requiring more maintenance and changing how the stone looks. Let's take a first-hand look at how different stones react to acidity. For presentation purposes, we're using acid to speed up and dramatize the results. The effect you'll see here is equivalent to what you might expect to see after prolonged exposure to lemons, tomatoes, and other acidic foods. So what I have here is limestone. You can see that this reacts to acid. Limestone is not suitable for kitchen countertops. This is dark, polished marble. Note that the surface is eroded. Here I have polished white marble. Note that the surface is eroded and the finish is removed, but it is less visible in the white marble than the dark marble. And lastly, I have honed white marble. Note that the surface is eroded, but it is less visible in white honed marble than with dark or polished marble. These materials are reacting to the acid because they are what's known as magnesium or calcium carbonates. Some people like the worn or patinaed look that occurs with these natural stones, and other people want a material that will remain less changed over time. So let's do the same thing to some marble alternatives and see what happens. Now this is quartzite. Note that there's no acidic reaction at all. What I have here is basalt, schist, and granite. These materials have a different makeup. They are not calcium or magnesium carbonates, so they won't react to acid. You'll see no chemical change to the surface of the material, just like with the quartzite. In addition to acid sensitivity, it's also important to take into consideration a material's abrasion resistance, or likelihood to scratch, as well as its porosity, or likelihood to absorb oils or liquids. And remember, no matter which stone you choose, any natural material will need to be sealed before use and maintained over time.